What is up guys, MJPP back again once again for another episode of our Pokemon Platinum Grasslock. I believe this is our 20th episode and today we're going to be taking on the 6th gym and hopefully doing some of the story. Um, so, the team we have for the gym today as you can all see, we have our Cradley, uh, level 45. Um, same move set, I believe. We have Torterra, level 40. Also, rocking with Earthquake. And we have Musha Breloom, level 41. Which did learn Seed Bomb at this level. Which will be big going forward. Just a nice, powerful Grass type move. Unlike the rest of the team, uh, who don't have. Unless, unlike my other physical. Grass Pokemon who have Razor Leaf. Um, so, I think what I'm going to do is start with Torterra, who I believe is the only one with two lines left. Uh, so, hopefully, that will reduce any casualties. I see, I see, you have defeated my son, but that's no surprise, he still has much to learn. You place my son rock, I, Byron, will take your turn. So, we could argue that uh, we're getting towards the latter stages of the game, but a lot of story is going to be happening uh, pretty soon. So, um, there's, there's still quite a long way to go, uh, we've got another two gyms, uh, the whole storyline, that did a lot of damage, probably because it, it was a special move, I don't think I have the best special defense, so for the one shot, yes, okay, so that's Magneton down. Oh, I almost made it to level up. Um, I think I can take whatever is Steelix throws at me. So I'm just going to go for another work quick. I'm actually faster, which is which is big. Um, and it's half though. Ice Fang. Um, oh, okay. Now because I'm faster. To do that, <laughs> we'll just kill it, and then I will heal up before when his Bastion comes out. I presume it's going to be above level 40. Uh, so I'm not level 41. Got 3 extra HP. Uh, 41. Okay. Yeah, my team's basically on par with uh, with everything around at the moment, apart from Cray Dilly, obviously. Um, that's a sort of higher level than everyone else, just because of the, uh, the gifts. So it's going to Stone Edge, shouldn't do too much. Yeah, not a lot at all. Uh, and we're just going to go for the Earthquake. Still rock, isn't it? So it should do some big damage. Oko is, in fact. Nice, okay. That's probably one of the easiest gyms I've ever been in. Um, cool. <laughs> so that's our sixth gym badge. And so give us a flash cannon. Steel type move could be useful in the next gym, not gonna lie. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and depart the gym. Uh, hopefully, we can do a lot of the story today. Um, because that didn't take much time at all. 
five minutes ish, if that. Hey, that's the mind badge. Good going. You're tough enough to consider becoming the Pokemon champ. Of course, I'm tougher, so it's not going to actually happen. Anyway, come with me to the lab. Right, I will join them at the library um, once I've got my team. And I believe I have an encounter. So, we're going to hit up random org. Uh, random.org. We're going to hit up that because I believe, I do believe, that I caught a. Um, An onyx in Iron Islands. Uh, so let's go ahead and check that out. Let me just. Yeah, there it is. There's the onyx. Um, so let's put the film back in the team. The Robin. And of course, the big boy. Big boy Tropius. Right, okay, so it is a level 32. That's a decent level. A level 32 Onyx. And we have. We want 1 to 3. We get 1. Okay. <laughs> and then we want 1 to 5. 4. That's a, that's a C dot, isn't it? Doesn't C dot... Doesn't Nuzzle also evolve by Leaf Stone? So... That's not going to be too useful, is it, I don't think. Okay, so we've got a level 32 Nuzzle Leaf. That's going to be... Could be a decent Pokemon, though, for a start. Level 32, I'll do that in between episodes. Um, I haven't really got anything for the next gym though. The next gym's going to be difficult, I think. Yeah, I have a feeling I could get swept. So I might take in a couple Pokemon that have two lives just to use as sacks. Um, because I'm really not I'm really not feeling it. Especially the process. The process is gonna be very tricky um, for me anyway. Unless nah, because it'll be quicker than me. Torterra does have two lives though. So Torterra could be my chance at taking down the Frostlass. Um, hmm. It's going to be difficult. Uh, that's for sure. But yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see, I guess. Bombs of wild beings in there, so I can't 
do a TM. Um, I'm thinking if I have, if I get two levels on, hmm, I'm not too sure to be honest. If I get two levels on Kathia, maybe? Or do I just go for someone in my team? I feel like I should probably. I feel like I should probably start giving things to Pokemon that aren't on my team just in case. So, I think what I'm going to do, if, if, if I were to lose a Pokemon right now, out of the ones, what am I doing, I can fly, out of the ones that are available to me, in the box, um, where are we at, so, yeah, we go to, Veilstone thing. Uh, the Pokemon I'd probably most likely use would be between Cacnea, Rotom, and Grovar right now. Especially if Nuzzy does indeed evolve by Leafstone, which I feel like it does. I feel like it's a Leafstone. Same with Lombro, which in that case. I'm not going to be able to get them. Um, this is a shame because Luigi Polo could be. If, if I end up getting the low sides, I might have to do some underground uh, farming. Yeah. Nothing, damn it, okay. Um, I mean, this is a big battle. I'll probably raise a leaf for it. Just hit it. Get some, get some free experience before I head into, into the lake. That's a good. 414. Not a lot, but, you know, we'll take it. <laughs> okay, so we're going to be going to the lake. I believe I face Saturn for the first time. Uh, so I think it's time for the Lord and Saviour Son because Son is obviously our. Okay. Cameras are cut out for a bit there, but we move, we move. So, we could have led in with Mushroom, but that's okay. Uh, I think what we're going to do is, well, are you very fine. So, yeah, we'll just go for a fly. Okay, so uh, I'm imagining you have something like a Krogon. There's a second Pokemon, maybe. I'm thinking we should kill. Yeah. Cool. Decent. Mercury. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we just go for another flash. Um. Hmm. Okay. So. I think what I am going to do is give two levels to mm, you know what I think I'm going to give two levels to your boy Cacnea I think Cacnea could be a uh, could be a big play Get a nice type in 
if someone were to go down. Uh, so yeah, well, I'm going to give two levels to Cacnea um, for, for this one, just in case, you know, uh, someone dies. So we're going to pop it on two extra levels. Um, I can't quite remember what level he is actually. But I can't really see him because I did that last time. So. Uh, yep, I think we'll fly uh, yet again. <laughs> I think fly is going to be looking like the best for now. Um, See, I think maybe this episode I'll try to do the to the lake areas and then we'll hop up into just gonna win it out, it's gonna be some decent damage yet. We're gonna fly again. Uh I think in the next episode we'll probably make our way through the snowy route, which is kind of annoying. Um, in the 40 cave as well. Uh, I might go through the 40 cave before the start of that episode, so we're, so we're just in the snow to start off. Uh, we're not going to learn synthesis, that's not going to happen. Um, and I'm imagining I'm going to have to do some, some serious grinding. Uh, before the seventh gym, just because yeah, it's a nice start gym, and there's no way that anyone's really living. I mean, Cradilly is probably my best shout, along with Breloom. Uh, so, yeah, might be that. Cradilly needs to get to a nice high level. Okay, cool. Now I'll put one down. We get another tiny bit of experience. We're not going to fly with an earthquake. Get a super effective move off. Look at the experience gain. It's unreal. <laughs> Earthquake. Do, 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 do. A bit more. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to raise you. Still start. Hey, that was fire. Oh, I didn't quite feel. Shame. Uh, yeah, let's just get another one. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Uh, so we fly. 
Oof, okay, nice supersonic. Big. That's big. Number 38, so we're not bad by any means. Hmm, that's a bit less than I wanted to do that. Uh, so I think I'm going to do this. Check into the, to the monster. Uh, neutral damage only, we can ancient power. And then we're going to flinch. For it. I know, that card doesn't do it, so that's the air slash. That should be gold bar down. Ooh, got a boost. Okay. I have the uh, incentive to stay up, as long as the toxic card doesn't come out next. Bronze wall. Okay, I don't have an incentive to stay up, because I literally can't do anything to that. Um, hmm. I mean, I guess it has leather tail, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, we'll go on to the leather tail. It's not a biggie. Iron defense, now it's a biggie. Um, yeah, we'll go for a bite, I guess, then. We're so just gonna keep on iron defense. It's at plus four now, I and mean, that's kind of annoying. Got the flinch. It's not going to get plus six. This could be a long, long battle, guys. Shadow roll. Doesn't do a lot. I'm going to die. Hopefully, we'll get a couple of flinches, make it quicker. And again, nice. And again, oh, big crit, nice. Oh, I'm going to juice the sound of it. Here comes the toxic coil. Now, I'm thinking I'll just go for the earthquake. Poison jar, okay. Doesn't do too much. Earthquake. A stab. I believe it's still super effective. It is. Okay. I wasn't too sure of fighting just the ground there, wasn't it? Level 42 for Tortella. Which is uh, very good. Now. All I've got to do is exit the cave and make my way to make Verity. Um, but I do need to heal. So I'm going to go to Sanjum. Stop off fire Pokemon Center here. Thank you. Cool. And then, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, do, we'll try to do this later as well. Could become a bit of a longer episode, but there's nothing wrong with that. Don't mind a longer episode. Team. 
Slightly higher level, I think. I can't remember what the first one was actually. But it should be going down, is indeed. And that's gone. So, dream, dream team, the double battle was right here. Uh, you've got your flying and ground side. Your earthquake. What would be good if I, if I had, like, if air cutter was viable to me. That would, uh, not, yeah, I'd have like the best doubles team. 
Okay, and here we have another admin fight with Mars. First time we've seen her since the Valley Windworks. Uh, she was a bit problematic, I believe. Can't remember. That was feels like a long time ago. Probably because it was. Um, right. You know what? We're gonna go for a fly. Good stuff. Heck, I could to get a crit. Doesn't. We fly. There's another one for us. We're just going for the crit. Fly. We land. Should be about half. No, under half, okay. Um, with another fly. So we're gonna end up taking at least three air classes. Which is looking a bit bad. Just for a toxic. Ooh. Okay. So we're gonna fly. It's gonna take it down to red. Yeah. Uh, and then we're gonna body slam, I think. Okay, so another air car. I might get a crit this time. Does get a crit, I think. No? That was normal damage, okay. Probably just looked like it did more. Uh, cool. Decent experience. A bronze ore. Oh my god. Uh, right, we're swapping out. Into Torterra. And we're gonna go through the same thing. <laughs> we're just gonna bite until this thing dies. <laughs> Doesn't do that much. Bite. Yeah. And it's gonna plus okay. Yep. Of course. I'm gonna bite. Okay, there's so much damage. That's a plus four as well. Could redo really the crit, because that is the next to nothing, and it's confused me as well. That's brilliant. I haven't got a single flinch yet either. Land. Yes, okay, flinch. Land. Yes, we love that from you, Totoro. Why have you not flinched? You have an ability which makes it just so you can't flinch. I swear you can't get that. <laughs> flinch. Oh my gosh. What is this, man? Right, what am I on, please? Okay, still should be fine. I'm slowly biting this man to death. This is very boring. <laughs> One more, yeah. Don't crit, please. Just don't do it. Cool. Bye. Die. Die, you absolute annoyance. Goodbye. Cheers. Probably. I do get Aerial Ace. That's the only thing I'm thinking about. Does it know Aerial Ace? Um, I doubt it's gonna. I'll, I'll probably go for like Fake Out or something, won't it? So, we're gonna do that. Just for Slash. Okay, so no Fake Out. Decent. We'll go for a drink. I'm not quicker than a Poraji. Are you joking? If a drain punch, see how much that gives me back. So the crit slash is going to be. Is it going to be a lot? Oh, nice. Okay. Just straight one shot. Almost got all my health back. That's unreal. Unreal from my car. Oh my gosh. Absolutely unreal. Okay. Um. So yeah, that's going to be the end of the story for now. We're going to end up talking about 
the, the, uh, the being trio deities that we saw in Celestic Town. Uh, and that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. Hope you have enjoyed. Um, and yeah, peace.